So I've been using these products for about two weeks now and I have formed some opinions on these products. So stay tuned if you would like to hear what they are. Let's start with the Rimmel foundations. I think that these are really beautiful. I do have a dedicated video trying out these foundations and the concealers. Um, for me, these are definitely a win. They make my skin look nice and smooth and I really enjoy that. Next is the Spotlight Primer from Physicians Formula. This is gorgeous as a highlight. I've only tried it once as a primer and it does a decent job, but doesn't fill in pores or anything like that. The Milani foundation in the lighter color is just a tad too light for me, but it's the same formula as the other shades and I do really enjoy this. Next we have this Bronze It Powder by L'Oreal. It has just a hint of sheen and it's a cool tone, so I especially love this for my temples and for carving out my cheekbones. It's really beautiful. I have a dedicated video swatching these highlight sticks. If you guys are interested in seeing those tried on, head over there and check out that video. The Rimmel Magnifies Color Edition Palette. Some are a bit chalky, some are nice, so it's kind of hit or miss for me. The Milani Make It Last Setting Spray I've been using in place of my MAC Fix Plus. So much cheaper, so it's a good alternative. The L'Oreal Shimmerista, I love this as an inner corner highlight. The Physicians Formula Rosé All Day is a really beautiful primer serum. I love the pink glow it gives my skin. It's really nice and not an overpowering fragrance at all, so I like that. And unfortunately, I have not had a chance to try out this palette other than the blush in it, which is a beautiful pink. Um, so I think that I will try this in the upcoming weeks and post a dedicated video. The Maybelline Primer. I have a dedicated video to show you what this does to the lashes, so go ahead and check that out. And finally, the Kevin Aquan Molten Lip Glosses. The glitter is a bit on the gritty side, so you feel it on your lips, so it's not my favorite glittery gloss option. But they do have some really unique colors, so check them out if you're interested. So that's it for my wrap-up. See you in my next video. Bye, guys.